Okay, we're gonna go on a quick little ride here with the missus. She's in the rear. She's learning, she's been doing real good. I'll let her pass me so you can see what she's riding. So she's on her Ninja 400. She's had it for about two months, a month and a half. And so far she's been doing real well. We've been just doing these back country roads. A little loop here we do to a school and back and sometimes we go out a little farther. Just depends if she's feeling it or not. Don't want to push her. But she does need to get exposed. She's been doing good though. So she's got a 2020 Ninja 400. So far I, what I've done to it, I, as you can see I got rid of the fender. Put that TST Industries uh, integrated t uh, tail light. I got her new grips on there. I put some rim tape, reflective rim tape uh, yesterday. I got her slip-on muffler, the Leo Vinci LV10, I think. And yeah, she's she's good to go. Still need to get her some frame sliders and so I'm letting her lead and see how far she wants to go. Pretty soon we'll be signing up for the MSF course. And so last year, this was uh, the road I was up and down on, and when I was learning on my um, on my Sportster, I just take off and explore these back roads. And traffic is not too bad back here. You got to watch out for the farming um, equipment. Sometimes they're crossing back and forth, but. It's a good road to learn on. Last year, when I got the Harley, she was like, okay, next year I'm gonna get me a Harley so we can start riding together. Uh, she didn't talk too much about riding again, but then <clears throat> I came home with that Ninja 400 for her and then I think she likes the sport, sport bikes better than the and the Harleys because uh, she wanted a Lowrider S. Okay, well, let's, let's start you off on a 400. Uh, the, I don't think she wants a Lowrider S anymore. She likes that 400 and maybe she's going to want uh, another sport bike later on. We'll see, but she's doing good. I d she did start on a dirt bike though on our KLX 140L. So we started around the house, showed her the friction zone and walking it back and forth, just just clutch and shifting, came along and yeah, she's been doing good. And then, well, the next step is out here and the bike on the roads. Kids are getting older, man. Our kids are getting older, so they don't want to hang hang with us as much anymore. So it's just me and me and Mama. So that's the way it goes. And let's just ride then. She did have a spill on a dirt bike, but you know, that's what the dirt bike was for, just to, to learn. It wasn't bad. So we usually pull into this school over here and loop back around. Sometimes we go out a little further. I'm gonna see, I'm gonna let her decide and see where she wants to go. She wants to just turn it back home or stretch out the legs a little and go a little farther. I'll let her lead. Let's 
see she gonna go left go right what's she gonna do all right we're going right we're going farther this time she does get frustrated sometimes when at the stop signs she'll stall once in a while There you go. That's just trying to turn the blinker off. There you go. Nice and easy. She goes. She don't want none of this. <laughs> there you go, baby. You got this. There you go. Nice and easy. Good turn. Gotta get used to those signals and canceling them herself. That's a big street coming up, big intersection. Alright, watch this truck here. See where she's gonna go. First time going left. Now let's see what she does here. She's gotta come to a complete stop and not freak out and let them pass. There you go. I still gotta get her to just put one foot down. There you go, baby. She's getting it. She's getting it. That's real good. Oh, better than me. I got went into neutral. Now from here, I'm gonna take over the lead because she hasn't been this way before. I want her to follow me. We're gonna probably pull into the residential area here and just loop back around. Maybe we'll go a little further. Let's go a little further to a another residential that's not even ha doesn't even have any houses yet. We'll just sit there and talk a bit. So we'll be hanging a left here. She does need gas, but I wonder if she wants to take it a little further, get some gas. But I'll ask her right now. Turn it here, turn it around. All right, she did good. What do you think, guys? Comment down below, so let her know how she did. I'm proud of her. Look at her. <laughs> A badass. Meanwhile, I can't get a neutral. Good? Huh? You did good? How do you feel? Okay. Alright. Were you scared? How about when that semi was coming and you had to turn? You were just stayed in your lane and waited, right? No, I didn't get I thought I was going to fall off the bike when I took that turn. 
Oh, I didn't see you. I thought you looked good. I mean, did, what, did you feel the tire slip? Oh, okay. Um, cause you were trying to. I saw that you shook a little. It's cause you were trying to cancel your signal. Yeah, cause it's like I have to like try like. Okay, well, just next time, just get going, get in your um, your get up to speed, and w then worry about the signal where you can look up. If you're going too slow to be looking down, then then um, yeah, you're gonna lose balance. But uh, once you get do your turn, get your get to your speed, take off, and then. Then you can look w real quick and look for your signal and just turn it off. Good job, though. I was going to say, you just want to keep going further so you can fill up your tank. <laughs> no, I'll get some gas for you. <laughs>